will urge uh, mm -hmm. the uh, national controller and the director uh, to coordinate all this, uh, although they are minimal, it needs to be captured. Uh, so we would request in the next uh, uh, 24 hours tomorrow, uh, as soon as you have your reports, uh, we would appreciate if uh, uh, it can be sent immediately. And uh, actions that uh, you have taken in order to address uh, the needs and, of course, uh, quantifying the cost as well, uh, so that we can uh, have a record of all this. Uh, that's the first uh, issue that I wish to raise. Uh, secondly, uh, as usual in all previous disasters, uh, starting from 2009, after every um, uh, disaster, we, we always have what we call the post-disaster uh, debriefs. Uh, we need to capture the key lessons learned. Uh, while we have been spared, there are still weaknesses in the systems and processes. And of course, uh, uh, the assistant minister has talked about uh, policy issues and structural issues. Uh, these are the things that we need to take on. Because previously, we have very good reports, but it's just filed away and we wait for the next one. That is why we have always been reacting. Now, uh, I have reiterated the other day that since 2009, government's key statement was the shift from a culture of reaction to a culture of prevention, being proactive. In that way, we will minimize the risks and losses and, of course, ensure that there is consistency in our economic performance and, most importantly, growth as well. Lessons learned are important and we need uh, to uh, be briefing and uh, uh, informing our policy makers so that necessary changes have to be uh, made as well. And of course at the lower level, operational issues, uh, these are the things that we need to address. So I will again with the coordinator, we will arrange the time uh, for all of this. Uh, additional to what the air system means that has taken. Okay, well, uh, I think from here, uh, while we will be awaiting the assessments and the reports, at the same time, as raised by the Land Force Commander yesterday, uh, we need to start looking at how we can assist uh, uh, our brothers in uh, and sisters in Vanuatu. Uh, as of this morning, for your information, uh, I think uh, Fiji Airways. Uh, is waiting for clearance from Vanuatu uh, to uh, send a flight across uh, to probably uh, expect our people who uh, need to be brought to Fiji.